Hey folks, it's Andre from Logo, a logo and brand design platform. In this video, I'm gonna walk you through the four main font categories, tips for choosing the best fonts for your brand, and I'll also suggest some great font pairings. Let's get into it. First, we have serif fonts. Serif fonts are like a full-bodied cabernet. These fonts are classic, timeless, and historical. Brands like Rolex, Mercedes, Prada, and Dior use serif fonts. The word serif actually means a slight projection or stroke of a letter. Research shows that these little strokes on each serif letter help to create an easy line for readers to follow. Serif fonts are often used in print as body text. Next, we have sans serif fonts, which are more modern and clean, like a crisp gin and tonic. Cheers. Sans serif fonts are categorized by crisp lines and can be used in heavier weights for bold looks or light weights for more airy, minimal looks. Sans serif fonts are the go-to for digital platforms and online businesses because of the easy legibility and simple style. Brands like Google, Spotify, Netflix, and Looka use sans serif fonts. Next up, we have script fonts, otherwise known as cursive fonts. These fonts are categorized by curvy, wispy elements that mimic handwriting. Think of a flirty, friendly, cosmopolitan. Script fonts can either be formal or casual. Formal script is great for more elegant uses like black tie events and weddings. These fonts are elaborate and artistic. Brands like Cadillac and Cartier use more formal script fonts. Casual script looks more like a person's real handwriting. They can be a little bit more rough and scratchy, but also more practical looking. Hallmark, Virgin, and Ray-Ban all use casual cursive fonts in their logos. Lastly, we have display fonts, or decorative fonts. These fonts are original, creative, and full of personality, like a sangria. Display fonts come in many varieties. The point of using a display font is to grab attention with a really unique look. These fonts are great for statements, signs, bold headings, and of course, logos. Sega, Disney, and Baskin Robbins all use display fonts in their logos. Notice how much upfront character these fonts convey about a brand. Sega looks ultra futuristic, while Baskin Robbins is quirky and youthful. Now that we've covered the four main font types, let's go over some tips for selecting the best font for your brand. Tip number one, match your font to your brand's personality. Fonts convey a lot of character, so before you go choosing a font, think about the mood or feeling you're trying to create with your brand. Let that dictate the style that you select. Tip number two, consider your audience. It's important to think about your audience and how they might respond to your font choices. Is your audience an older, more professional crowd? Using Comic Sans probably isn't the right choice. Okay. Using Comic Sans is never the right choice, but you get the idea. Tip number three, think of how you use your font. Are you choosing a font that's just for a logo or is it for a website or other marketing material? Will you use it mostly in print or digital too? How big should it be? Will it scale down well? For example, display fonts and more elaborate script fonts do better in larger formats, but the smaller they get, the more detail is lost and the harder they are to read. So make sure you consider how and where you'll be using this font before making a final decision. If you want more tips on selecting the right font for your brand, check out our blog in the description below. Now, let's get into font pairing. The first thing I'm gonna say about font pairing is please don't pair more than two fonts in a logo, please. An insider tip on font pairing is to stay within the family. Choose a font family with different variations and weights and combine them. This will help you maintain a balanced and consistent look. For example, Archivo comes in weights ranging from bold to heavy to light and thin. Pair Archivo black with Archivo thin and you've got a great font combination. The trick to pairing fonts is to aim for a subtle and balanced contrast. Serif and sans serif fonts pair well together, especially in contrasting sizes. Here's a list of popular font pairings for different brand styles. Don't worry about writing these down. We got them all in the description down below. Going for a more modern look? Try League Spartan and Libra Baskerville. If you're aiming for something stylish, try Rufino and Sintoni. Need to create a professional appearance for your brand? Go for Work Sans and Lado. If you're going for an elegant vibe, try Parisienne and Roboto Light. For a bold look, pair Bebas New and Montserrat Light. For a minimal look, try Railway and Open Suns. Want more font pairing ideas? Check out our blog below. 
After you've picked the logo to edit, click name on the left. You'll see the suggested fonts menu. From here, you can browse fonts by style and see how they look on your design. That's all folks. Go forth and build great looking logos and brands with your newfound font knowledge. Try Luka and design your logo in under 10 minutes. Cheers. Hey, who made sangria? Nice.